the tall brand like why did you go and ruin it for like no no need to get into the bed ah! oh my god y'all see that shit let me slap that major in my basket real quick big black puffer girl who is styling that though i shouldn't do it though it's not a smart idea i want to feel like a girly girl i'm five four trying to be five eight risky oh my god it was on my side Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. It's your girl Louise, little Louise pick one. Nothing else, little Louise pick one. And you know the hard is really not that hard, period. Over 2021, I think I changed my style about five million times. Like in the beginning of 2021, you couldn't catch me dead in a dress. Like it was not going to happen. In a skirt too, yeah, um, bye. I remember like, a, like probably like one or two years ago, me and my best friend Lisa literally pledged that we never ever wear a skirt or dress again in our lives. And the baggy jeans was the way to go for the rest of life baggy jeans and sweatshirts yeah we were gonna dress tomboy but everything baggy if it's not baggy we didn't want it we didn't want to wear it that was the style that we were gonna go with for life i'm not kidding but when summer came i felt like i really just wanted to change my style a little bit and i was just seeing all these girls wearing baggy jeans and then tight top and me being insecure i knew i had to go on some kind of like weight loss so i can wear these tops so i started gymming and i started wearing tight tops like this one and i was like if i wear this top and baggy jeans it's all right so that's what i did you you can't see my ass in baggy can you you can you can august september and october but by the time november came yes one of the coldest months of the year i wanted to start wearing dresses and skirts why do why i don't know like i couldn't tell you i, I literally couldn't tell you i think maybe what could have changed is the fact that obviously i moved out in september and i made so many more new friends so just seeing everybody else's style it wasn't really much in mind and i just felt like i was really just really behind with the trend people don't like to admit it but i'm a trend follower i will follow the trends i will follow the trends i just felt like i was really falling behind and pinterest sometimes it it lies to you it will show you what you want to see not what's trending at the time see, all my friends they were wearing like all these nice clothes i remember on lisa's birthday everybody was wearing like you know glitz and glam and i was like what the hell am i wearing i would literally insert a picture of what i wore yeah that outfit i really wish i didn't wear but it was really a last minute thing because i saw everyone's outfit last minute then i was like what am i doing with my life yeah right now i'm going through the biggest identity crisis you can call it i'm going through a crash, crash, crash. i'm going through a fashion crisis and i'm basically calling it identity because i don't even know myself anymore i don't even know me who am i i don't know myself i don't know myself i don't know myself who am i sometimes i really want to be girly but sometimes i just want to wear sweat sweatpants a whole era of just wearing baggy stuff it's over crossing that shit out my life i'm not even joking right now the time right now is 208 i was just like you know what i'm fed up of this i was watching euphoria and i stopped to do this because i was like i am so tired of just being sick of my own clothes and just saying i have no clothes when i literally have a wardrobe full of clothes of clothes i just don't want to wear basically we're gonna go shopping don't forget to press those two buttons down there press the like and subscribe it's completely free helps me helps the whole family to grow and while you're at it don't forget to follow me on insta 6 and all my other social medias are in the description below boom i've made a mini list of things that i am aiming to buy and we're just gonna go through the list get in loser we're going shopping okay so obviously trousers is so important if you don't have trousers it's literally like trousers protects the most sacred part of your body and tops and shoes yeah we are definitely avoiding any sorts of baggy jeans baggy cargoes is kind of cute it's so hard to find the right pair of cargo pants because every single cargo pants in this entire world is cuffed who the hell is shopping for cuffed cargoes so we are gonna go on a mission to find uncuffed cargoes before we go shopping i want to show you guys um what like my my vision board is saying so just for like winter fashion i'm it's more like moving to spring right now this is just what's in my i know there's a lot baggy but let's just pretend that the girls aren't wearing baggy but this is just the vision a little bit this is what i see for myself yeah it's it's, it's looking a little bit like this 
It looks a bit basic, actually. Anyway, scrap that. We're looking for cargoes right now. And I'm going to say uncuff because, baby, we do not need cuff. So here we have Shein, 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 and Shein. I don't really want to buy my cargoes from Shein. Not because I don't like Shein. I don't have anything against Shein. But it's, it doesn't sit right with me. So we got Hollister here. Let's look at the misguided pants. Boohoo. It's a boohoo man. Okay, so let's look at what we have. So we have Shein selling these cargoes that are beige. But I don't know. I like that little detail of red. Now, why would you add that? Like, why would you go and ruin it for? Like, this is not really what I'm looking for. I'm looking for the drawstring, like, the end bits. This is just, like, baggy bottoms. Like, I don't need that. Who needs that? Like, why? Why? No, no. This is definitely not. These cargoes? Ooh. They're nice. But see them bottom bits? Now, that is a bit of a Because who told you to cut the bottom bits? That is mad. Yeah, that's not happening. The misguided pants. These are not bad. Only problem about these pants is you see this little thing that's going on right here. I don't get it. Like, why can't it just be a button up? Like, I wish I could just make my own shop and just like, like. And then when I look at suggested, this is actually very, 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 very cute cargo pants. But I don't know if anybody understands. So I'm going to have to show you. A few months ago, I did buy some cargoes from ASOS. But unfortunately, they weren't my size. Cargo pants, they came in a size 12. Because it was the last size they had. And literally, that was just my luck. I Maybe someone returned it. And then I just happened to be at, there at the time when it was put. And then I got it. Luckily, my luck. What can I say? It's literally the perfect colors I've been looking for. It's perfect color. The bottom base is perfect. It's a button up. The reason why I need it to be a button up is that because when you pull something, it may not pull to the end. And I can always just like sew the sides of a button up. It's just been out stock since November. We're in January. What's going on, baby? I've heard that H&M sell really good cargoes because that's where, like, everybody gets their car. Let's go over and look at H&M if my internet wants to work. Oh What's going on right here, baby? Like, why now? Why is the internet acting up now? It's acting up for the camera. Don't embarrass me like that. Here we have a range of things from H&M. I do like these, but see, it's not the bottom bits I'm looking for. These cargoes, it's just, it's just all the same thing, really. Like, you see these cuffs? Need to get into the bin for a while. <gasps> I've heard that Urban, Urban have really good cargoes. Cargoes, 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 cargoes. Ah! Oh my god, y'all see that shit? Y'all, this is making Urban. Damn, y'all. But they looking good. I'm not gonna lie. These ones here, they made me scream. <laughs> they look good, 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 good. Let me slap that medium in my basket real quick. Look at these. Oh, baby. Baby, this is what I came for. This, I don't shop at Urban, but we're gonna have to put this in the back burner. Uh, yeah. We need something to make it look nice on the top and obviously I need to get a gelée and I've been really eyeing the North Face gelée for a long time. I did go into store to go and try it on but I happened to forget that I wanted to buy it. The black one is what I initially wanted to get. But the thing is... You have a big black puffer jacket even? So I don't know how it's gonna work because I already have a black North Face jacket. I didn't really think it through. The gelée in black. It's beautiful, like a man delay. I'll just get in a small. Like the only colors that they have, well, they had when I was there was the pink one, which is not really a nice pink, and they had a yellow one for girls. And I'm like, wait, girl, who is styling that though? Oh, this is on sale. But you see, I don't think it says Diablo. If you guys translate Diablo, yes, it's in Spanish. That means devil. 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 Yeah, I'm gonna have to pass on that one. Thank you very much. This color, is this stylable though? That Diablo bullshit is making me scared. This, the only thing that's putting me off is I don't know how to style red. I don't have anything red in my wardrobe because me and red just don't work out. 
the men's 1996 retro nuptials. It's a three star rated. I know these jackets are good quality as they used to be. Very thin. I wouldn't order online this product again. This lime green, definitely not feeling. But when you see that black, do you see the black? I would literally just buy the black for bands. It it looks like my jacket was nicely, but it it when you see it, it does say to you. Like I shouldn't do it though. It's not a smart idea. I don't know. Shoes gelé. Okay, so here we have. It's just the ugly crimson pink that I just do not. I'm not feeling it. It's just not me. It's not a bit me. No. Mm, nah. 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 That ain't gonna work, baby boo. <laughs> a varsity jacket now i did put this on my list a couple months ago but i feel like right now i'm really off varsity jacket i know the best probably from asos but after i watched euphoria i really want to dress like one of them and none of the girls wear varsity jackets now i'm trying to be maddie i ain't trying to be what's that crackhead part bro no I, I i'm looking at the varsity jacket i feel like cargo's varsity jackets and some trainers banging out for any crop top bro but am i really willing to spend 50 pounds on a jacket that doesn't even keep me warm for fashion mm, i don't know i can spend that on shoes and that's what we're gonna do now Whenever I talk about shoes, I ain't talking about like heels. I'm talking about trainers because that's actually the only thing I own. I don't own anything but trainers. Jordans, Nike shoes, Balenciaga, that's the only sh I, I own. I'm not gonna care. I want to feel like a girly girl. I want to wear my skirt with boots. I want to wear my dress with some really nice loafers. I don't have any of that sh I'm gonna look for some nice loafers and some nice heels just to add to the collection a little bit. Do you feel me? I need to buy. Oh, they're doing 20 percent off. No, on sportsy stuff. Yeah, makes sense. Loafers to be exact. I like. I I'm trying to do Michael Jackson moment in this house. I have some loafer options right here. You see this? I feel like this shoe right here definitely is nice. I don't have wide feet though, so I need to find something that's not wide. I think I am going for a little bit of elevation. You know this. I'm feeling this. But is it velvet? Mm, velcro? Mm, suede. These, yeah, loafers. Or oh, I think you see these shoes right here. The only thing that's really putting me off is why am I going to be wearing slippers in public for everybody to be seeing my actually toes? Like, that's. No. 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 That. No. This is a bit of me, mate. This is a bit of me. But I feel like it needs to be higher than this. This is like school shoes. It means more. Pizzazz, it's just me. I need to look taller. I'm 5'4. I'm trying to be 5'8 in this hole. Are cute, but why are they brown? All the shoes I own are either black or white. I don't do color that much. Like, if I did a color, that means I really love that color because it was not black or white. It's scary. Like, that's risky. These are nice. I would risk it. Uh, oh, you see, when I see shoes like this, it makes me want to risk it. Mmm yeah that way now imagine these with a cute ass white skirt wait i'm really sure for like summer's tomorrow like we're in the middle of winter <laughs> you know what how's they get cold i think we got some loafers and the boots i really want it's like high heel boots imagine i typed in bad bitch boots would it actually come up bad bitch. oh mm -mm. this is not giving me bad bitch energy no mm -mm. this is not giving me bad bitch this is giving me bad without the high heel boots yeah this is literally what i'm talking about wearing jeans and some high heels literally this is exactly the vision that i was going for i feel like the heels too it's too big oh i feel like if this heel was fatter it'll be a cop immediately oh this is not me uh-uh Oh, oh, now we getting somewhere. These, <gasps> I think I just fell in love. Like, I fell in love, and that's okay. Oh my, y'all see that? D do you see these? Do you are you dumb? These are so beautiful. Amazing. I'm gonna have, oh my god, it goes my size. Like, cops that are what for the first time i like some boots and they don't have my size like can somebody literally help me jump up the roof because what 
to that depressing like just revelation that that is not in stock i don't want to buy boots anymore but i'm not gonna be salty i'm gonna go to the next best ones that i really liked and i think it was like these the reason why i wouldn't go for these after seeing these my expectations are too high I'll show like suggestions of what's like this i feel like these they're nice but this is something about ankle boots that makes me like Ooh! makes me feel the type of way so i'm just gonna go find the black version do you have my size it's just like why do i even try i'm gonna buy more tight fit tops like these you're gonna have to like just bury me because i am broke <laughs> So we're gonna have to hop over to Shein. I know like everybody hates Shein, but like somebody's gonna have to buy the clothes. I'm gonna take one for this team. If it's gonna have to be me, I'll do it. I'll do it for free, I'll do it. What I'm looking for is just some really classy tops. Like tops like, you know, if a boy was to ask me on a date, like I can just go to like on a date. Well, my friends say, let's go clubbing. I can just like throw on a, a top to go clubbing. Not that I would. But you know, the idea, the principle of having the top is nice. It's nice. Y2K top. It's like, it's just classy. Just class. Class. Here we have some tops. This is classy, but not showy. <laughs> like, one, like, I want to pull you for more, but I'm not gonna let you see my booby type shit, you know? Ooh. Mm hmm. Uh, uh, uh. This is very risky. <sighs> yes. This, this one, right? here is what i'm yeah this is this is what i envision this this is it let me just slap the size eight into the basket real quick i've always wanted to own a top like this but i just feel like me first of all i got no titties to be pulling it off look at it it's it's just padding it's padded bro it's padding do you know that top that has like all the laces here and then you just like tie it and then it just looks like I don't know if you guys know what i'm talking about <gasps> this top looks like a very it's literally got the wings oh slap that in the bag real quick do you see this top oh slap that hole in my immediately oh my the color is is it's 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 all of me my wardrobe is literally going through like 10 times 100 change yeah y2k is definitely the style that i'm going for plus i was born in that era like i was destined for it this top yes and this one the, the hearts i really wish that the bodies came with the top but unfortunately it doesn't so jim's gonna have to be seeing me every day like this top yeah it's giving me b i want to feel like just like confident like it's gonna be cold i don't care it's cold because the cold can't change who i am and who is that a bad puta si, si. oh do you know what top i've always wanted corset top with just like it just looks like let me write corset mm yeah something like this no oh this this one this one i'm not gonna check out yet because i also just want to do a bit more shopping my bank account's crying right now it's just here there here then all of a sudden you spent a thousand pounds just... to wrap it all up obviously accessories is a big 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 part in your dress sense i made a huge investment in this chain i lost it in canada and i bought i rebought it again so accessories jewelry wise i think i'm really out of my like my budget for buying jewelry but like bags i do have a million and one bags like no cap i have too many bags maybe you can't have enough shoulder bags i want a shoulder bag in every single color but i need the shoulder bag to rotate in the design because i just don't want it to be like this spaghetti bag it's the same was this baguette bag but it's just different color i want it to be a different style as well but i think i bought all my baguette bags from sheen except one that i bought from primark it's all being cheap i don't buy expensive bags i'm a cheap girl <laughs> it's the mindset baby this is certain shoulder bags that i really wanted my friend didi has it it's beautiful i've seen two girls have it i saw one girl have a party as well and i was like you know what this is a sign oh it's right here i was like this is a sign from god that i need to get this bag because this bag is beautiful like i have no white bags so i think this is a perfect bag to get in white And also tote bags. I feel like that is so in. And I don't have like a really cute tote bag. My auntie did buy me a bag from um, Canada. And I'll show you guys right now. Where is the bag? And I'm very grateful that she gave it to me. But it's just something that like. I, I just can't see myself wearing it for a very long time. Uh, just a cute tote bag. Go shopping. I really want it to be like white as well. Yeah. Mm. 
<laughs> Let's see if I type in tote bag online, what will actually come up? Tote bags, I mean, oh, 22 pounds. Who, who's gonna be buying that? No. I refuse to spend more than five pounds on a tote bag. Like, what's that about? I'm I'm gonna run back to Shein. <laughs> um, I don't know. When you buy a tote bag, you can't like. You need to have like a feel of the material. Is it good quality? Shein is just like hit or miss. Like, it's either like banging or it's just like what? What are you doing? So I think I might pass on this but when i go shopping i definitely i'm gonna look at tote bags in the future um is there anything that i'm really dying to buy all i need to do right now is go to the shop buy some tight buy some leg warmers feel good about myself go gym i'm just looking i do have clothes but i feel like you need a certain amount i know i feel like you need a certain type of clothing to make all the other clothes change it's like shift this style like i don't want to do the whole baggy situation like i said i also got like a really cute hat from canada this was like my first purchase of like my new style i was like this this is a bit of a adding it and elevating everything to make it look so much more better in 2022 makes me so excited and that leads on to me closing off this video thank you so much if you didn't make it this far all the clothes you guys will see on my instagram so don't forget to follow me you guys will be seeing it in the coming future by the grace of god like and subscribe again don't forget to follow me on instagram all my other socials are in my bio also be looking at my pinterest because i hope i'm going to be posting so much more on pinterest this year like it's three o'clock right now now, I am literally dead tired. It's been your girl Louise. <laughs> oh, girl. It's been your girl Louise. And I'll see you in my next YouTube video. And that's on what? And that's on period. Period. Pull up breakfast. Bye. And you.